Good morning, y'all. I know it's been a couple weeks um, since I did the, the stitch unboxing. So I figured I would bring you uh, my first update. It is a slow go because I haven't had a whole lot of time. Um, and I have been sick. So um, I've been doing... A couple minutes here and a couple minutes there working on this because I found if you do too much at once you might knock off the the rhinestones and stuff so I'll do about 20 minutes or so and then I let it sit overnight and dry so for my first update I got the back of his one ear this I started last night up through his the back of his head and the top of his head. Just see some glue um, strings. But I know in my unboxing video when I did the first couple I used uh, um, Loctite super glue, and it's just the only thing that I had handy. Uh, but I have been using since I had gotten the the bear keychain as well. It came with two tubes, two small tubes of the B seven thousand, E six thousand, whichever. Um, so I started using this on this. And it works pretty good. Gives you a little bit of time to set the rhinestones down. So, um, it does get difficult when you get down to the ears. To me, this is very time consuming. Um, obviously nothing like a regular diamond painting to where it lays flat um, at least when doing his head, you can sit him down on a table and place him. But most of the time, like from the back of his neck and the back of his ear, I'd have to hold on to it in one hand and then try to place the rhinestones with the other. But I know it'll look cute once it's done. It doesn't have to be perfect. I've learned a long time ago. You are your worst critic. You will find all the mistakes. And everything that has gone wrong. With whatever craft that you may be doing. And it takes a long time to just say. They're your imperfections. You see them faster than anybody else does. And not only, not only that, not everybody's going to look at it close up. So anyway, I hope everybody is having a good day. Good week. This is Tuesday for me. The beginning of December. Or December. Oh my goodness. Beginning of August. Oh my god, what am I thinking? I have no clue. Have not been feeling good. Not COVID. Just really bad virus. So yeah, a little bit of brain fog. But I hope everybody is having a good day, good week. Um, hopefully August is a good month for everybody. I just so happen to have a birthday in August. But after a certain age, it doesn't count. It's just another day. But anyway, I wanted to pop on here to show everybody how far I got. Hopefully, um, because I won't drag this out with several videos 
so I probably won't show another video of this until it is done. It will take a little while, because like I said, um, between being sick and working on all the products that I sell and make over at Fish and Creek Creative Turnings, uh, does not leave me a whole lot of time. I can barely get any diamond painting in, uh, which actually on my dirty cluttered table, I'm working on a stitch and a Grinch. Uh, but that's only until I can do, we start our patriotic uh, paint along over at Fish and Creek Creative Turnings on August 10th. So if you would like to do that, you can come on over. All I ask is for everybody that wants to join to answer all four questions and then I will accept you. Uh, we have the hand turned pens that my husband does. Um, my daughter and I, we make cover minders and we make keychains and necklaces and I make, um, diamond, diamond bowls for trash drills. This one so happens to be one that glows in the dark. Um, a lot of different products over there that we're slowly bringing out. So again, I will be checking in with this, this at least, hopefully, once I am done. And I got the stringies everywhere. Now, it goes fast, obviously, when you're working on a flatter surface. But like with his ears and stuff or anything that has... Um, curves, it gets kind of difficult and time-consuming. But it's still fun to watch them come together. And then, I don't know if it was on, I think it was on my TikTok, I didn't realize it is a piggy bank. My husband put the first two quarters in for our granddaughter. So, anyway, I will cut this short so you're not watching a 20-minute video of, you know, just me talking. So, I just figured I'd check in and say hi to everybody. And I want to remind everybody to always, always, please be kind. Do kind. Little things do go a long way. Happy drilling, y'all. Bye.